Sean Haney here with realagriculture.com in Louisville at National Farm Machinery Show. And right now I'm joined by... Dave Bogan, the marketing manager for the Maxim and Puma line for Case IH. Okay, so what are we standing in front of? What's We're standing the... in front of the Maxim 150, which is a top model in the new Tier 4B lineup for uh, Case IH and the Maxim family. Um, there is four other models, a 115, 125, 135, and 145, which actually come in a four-cylinder configuration. This particular model behind me is actually a 145 as well, but it's in a six-cylinder, which is why we're calling it the 150 to kind of note the difference between the two. Um, obviously, it comes with a Tier 4B technology, the SCR-only exclusive technology from Case IH with less componentry and really no um, operator interface. It just takes care of itself. It's all, all after the engine, um, a, a complete exhaust uh, emission system. So that allows the engines to do what they were always meant to do, which is to just produce power efficiently. And we have our efficient, efficient lineup of tractors. So with, with the efficiency in the engine, are we giving up any power? No, we're not giving up any power. Like I said, once again, we allow the engines to do what they were always meant to do, which is create power efficiently, horsepower efficiently. So. Okay. And um, in interesting hood design. Yes, we're, as, as you can see here, a very bold, kind of radical new look to the Case IH Maxim tractors here, which is going to make its way through all the high horsepower tractors in the coming years, but this just happened to be the first one in the lineup to get it. As well as you take a look at the roof cap as well, as you can see that is that has changed in design as well. As you see now, we have LED lighting all the way around, which is standard. You have eight LED lights, which are standard, and you can order up to 14 if you like for additional lighting as well. Yeah, a lot of units running, you know, 20, you know, a lot of farms running 24 hours a day. Correct. Uh, critical to have good lighting. For exactly. Yep. And also, just inside some of the barns, now it's become very dark in there when you're loading hay up, which is just obviously a great loader livestock tractor inside those barns. With the uh, aerodynamic hood, how fast does the unit go? Well, it will. It'll go the 50 kph or 30 miles per hour. You know, it does have that have that option in the 16 by 17 semi power shift transmission, or we can also order it in the CVT configuration as well. And once again, we'll have that that 30 mile per hour option that you can order. Um, in terms of length of the unit, uh, is the is the unit getting uh, shorter or is it the same size as prior? Model? It's very close to the six cylinder configuration of the Tier 4A, but in fact, it's it's approximately an inch longer in the wheelbase. And what what that does for us actually. And the four-cylinder was considerably shorter, but in our, our four-cylinder actually had the better turning radius. We've actually matched the turning radius, our four-cylinder, but gave it the six-cylinder stability. So you're kind of getting the best of both worlds, getting that smoother ride and at the same time having that, that better, better turning, turning radius for, for the end of rows and maneuvering around, around the, uh, the home, the farmstead. Can I get it in a track? <laughs> Not yet, but you can see we are obviously uh, um, showcasing track here. <laughs> well, thanks a lot for joining us today, and uh, enjoy the rest of the show. I will. Thanks. Cheers.